Welcome to another edition of Small Talk for You. This morning I wanted to take a look at exceptions and error handling in BA Small Talk because there's kind of two ways this is handled in BA, and this is a little different than the way things work in most other Small Talks in the sense that if you're in VisualWorks or Object Studio, you pretty much have to catch exceptions no matter where you are and then just deal with them however you see fit. In VA, things are a little different. In some cases, you have something like this, divide by zero, where you get what you expect out of Small Talk. You do this, you do a a display on this and I'll get back one because I'm saying on the zero divide error go ahead and return one and I get back one so on error do whatever however let's say that you're writing a network application so you set up an HTTP client and you go ahead and you do www dot whatever and here I put in a bozo URL so that I get the error but it could be anything I mean I wrote an RSS reader years ago in VisualWorks and quite frequently or else we just stop functioning for one reason or that you get back 500 errors, you get back all sorts of things from websites. You can't count on much of anything. So here I put in one that I know will fail. And what I'm doing here is just writing out to the transcript, if this thing is an SST error, I'm going to write an error out to it. So let's execute it, and it says error. Well, this is a little different than the handling up here. Here this is sort of the way you normally do things in most languages. You look, you try the code, you look for the error condition. If you find the error condition, you do some handling it's not exception handling. So these are two ways you have to do things. In most network code in BA Smalltalk, you're going to have this kind of pattern. Look for the error condition, handle that, and then move along. In other code, you're going to do this kind of thing where you handle the exception. So kind of two patterns that are going on in BA Smalltalk. You really have to be careful about which library you're using and how it was written. So you have to look for that and be aware of the difference in the way you're going to handle things. So that's better for today. Until next time, have fun with whatever Smalltalk you're using.